Buying a fixer upper can be a great idea. Getting to turn that shabby house into the dream home. If you have that vision and can see beyond the overgrown yard and peeling wallpaper and run down roof, you can land a property that another buyer and you will love someday. However, before you sign on that dotted line, there are a few things you should consider when purchasing a house that needs repairs. Now, generally speaking, cosmetic repairs cost much less, much less than when you have to do structural, electrical and plumbing repairs. There are a few red flags that may mean walking away from that deal and that fixer upper. Keep an eye out for structural concerns and foundation issues potential water infiltration issues, old dangerous electrical and wiring, walls that need to be moved, particularly if they're low bearing, significant window repair, all these types of things, it's probably best to speak to a contractor or a builder before you make any decisions. Because you need to see if the home is worth the investment. Will the budget work? Will you be able to afford those repairs? And please make sure you opt for a building inspection. It's important to protect yourselves and have the best chance of figuring out if there's going to be a hidden defect. So if you have questions about, fix, uh, about purchasing a fixer upper as an investment, reach out to me today. I'm always available to help you with your real estate needs. Fixer uppers can be a great investment, but they can also turn into a nightmare quite quickly. So do your due diligence, work with a professional. And as always in this market, more than ever, who you work with, that truly matters.